what's going on guys? It's 2017 and it's time to make America great. Great, wait a second, is that a microphone? <laughs> Get you a man that looks at a microphone like Donald Trump does. But anyway guys, it's me, Ethan Bradbury here, and we're back again in the world of Hearts of Iron 4. I mean, we never left to begin with. <laughs> and today we're whipping out the alt-right, the alt-right fucking guidebook because it's Brexit time in the in the Millennium Dawn modern day mod. Because if there was one thing my channel was missing, it's people in the comments with pictures of Adolf Hitler or Pepper. Pepe the Frog as their fucking pro- Just fucking gang me. Ed, Ed, why am I still doing this? Oh, hi guys, you feeling a bit down there? Join my Discord and feel worse. <coughs> oh, sorry, what was that about? Anyway, guys, back in, uh, hearts of boring four. And guess what? Look, Donald Trump's here and he's here. He's ready to build a wall and take down China. Oh, oh, uh, wait, is, is that, what is that? Is that a hairball? Is that like a lollipop that went under the sofa and collected? Oh, no, never mind. It's, it's Theresa May. Oh, yes. Theresa April, my favorite time of the month. Oh, boy. It's been, a, it's been a while since we came back to this millennium dawn, the modern day mod, hasn't it? And boy, I've sure, I've sure fucking missed it. But hey, look, all the focuses are almost done, which means half my job's well, all the jokes are out the window, so we're just gonna wing it this time, and it's January 2017, and we should probably do the whole Brexit thing. Okay, guys, while, while, uh, while Thierry Henry over here was in a fucking coffin, well, guess what? I lowered tax. Oh, wait, she's she's coming in. She's coming in. Pfft, Europe. Come on, guys. Who would want to be part of that mess? We've got much more interesting things to... Oh, shit, we actually... Fuck. I, I never, I never liked Europe anyway. They, they've all got stupid country names like Switzerland and Australia and, you know, the Islamic state. Wait a second, I don't... Is that... Uh, it's gotta... That's, that's probably right. Oh, how is this even up for debate? Come on, <laughs> stronger borders with Europe. Why would we want... Wait a second, isn't Germany in Europe? Yeah, for... On second thoughts, I don't want any of those sausage-eating pricks in my fucking country. Oh well, boy, it's that time again when we entrust the Northern Irish population with the most important thing that in the fucking world. That's right, a nuclear power station. Don't mess it up, guys. Don't mess it. You're going to mess it up, aren't you? So I don't know if you can quite, you know, grasp where I'm going with this, with this squiggly line pointing into the North Sea, but I quite, I'm slightly regretting this whole Leave Europe thing. I didn't think that was actually going to happen, and good old Hobgoblin McGee over here agrees with me. Sorry, Theresa January. But, you know, I've got a cunning and ingenious plan to get back into Europe via a, a neutral country full of people called Stefan and Ikeas. Uh, yeah. Oh boy, back in the shores of Europe we are, guys. And it, you, you go ahead, my little, my little fucking trucks just spread out and kill the fuckers. I mean, enjoy the culture. Uh, you might think this looks pretty devastating for the Swedes, but don't worry, they've suffered no casualties so far because, you know, they just surrender immediately. And so do the Norwegians, apparently. I'm not at war with you guys, you just... You're giving up to me. What's going on over here in Scandinavia? Oh, hey, guys. Just a usual European Parliament meeting. Has anyone noticed that Sweden's looking pretty red recently? No, they're always red, the communist pricks. <laughs> Laugh track. Don't want to critique the European Union since I did leave and then forcefully re-enter by invading another country, but you guys are just letting me walk through your country. I did leave. I Guys, I, I left. I, I shouldn't be able to do this. I mean, you've got to give it to them, aren't they? They've, they've done a lot of work to get it realistic. Look, Trump's building the wall, you know. Canada's being a little bitch. Uh, what else is going on over here in Europe? Oh, well, the Germans are doing the destroyer program. You know, usual stuff, just destroying the very fabric and ideals of the ethical policies of Europe, whilst also implementing a secret German Reich. Nice. Oh, and the French go Nazi. Okay, so I just read an article on BuzzFeed and apparently some bad stuff's going over here, on, down over here in Syria, but, you know, being the good guy that I am, I feel like I, it's my responsibility to go clean up the mess that I started. Oh, this is actually a pretty easy war. I don't know how they're struggling in real life, but mostly it's because we got the Turkish support. You know, the, the, guy, the, the country that's led by this guy that sounds like, his name sounds like Sylvester Stallone trying to pronounce anything. Oh, <laughs> you well, damn, that was that was surprisingly easy. Look, I just I just solved that whole problem over here quite easily. No more children getting gassed by um who was gassing them? 
I can't remember. Wait a second, did anyone notice there's a whole continent down here called South America? Hold on, I just had to Google this. Apparently we had a war about some sort of forks. What's going- What, what happened? I, I didn't even know this was in the game. Is this new? Aha, uh -huh, just kidding you. I knew that South America existed, but honestly... What, what is the point of it? What is, what is the point? I don't know how to explain this to you guys, but I, I accidentally slaughtered just the right amount of uh, Argentinian children in just maybe in a pentagon, um, a pentagram, sorry, and I, I may have summoned a demon. Yeah, it's Tim Farron. I've accidentally summoned the blood demon, Tim Farron. By the power of Tim Farron, we've killed all the Argentinians by accident. Wasn't on purpose, guys. I mean, how was I supposed to know if you shouted free tuition, free tuition in, in a, a fucking hexagon pentagram circle that it would summon the Lib Dem leader, Tim Farron, alright? I mean, I only had to spill a few litres of Argentinian baby blood, but that wasn't my fault. Oh no, Marine Le Pepe the Frog has managed to kick France out of the European Union. This is bad news for... F Wait a second, colonial ba- Hold on, we need to stop this. I, I just can't honestly believe I never knew there was a whole different c continent down here filled with countries. I mean, I'd love to hear the lore about how this got here. Is it a mod? D yeah, I don't, I don't know how much I can trust these damn Frenchies with their whole colonial policy thing, but I'm going to risk it. And immediately, Sao Paulo's life expectancy rates went up by 50. Wait a sec, they've still not patched out Germany joining the fucking war every time you drop a nuke, have they? Oh boy, okay, apparently, uh, the United States declared war on the Islamic State over here, and Donald Trump, he got a bit confused exactly what that was, so now he's doing the basic education reform to find out exactly where, where that is. Oh boy, what happened to this whole new continent down here that I was going to split between me and my friends? Well, don't worry, I did split between me and my friends France and Germany, but I managed to take all the provinces and all the loot, and then I just gave France the, the place with all the trees. Uh, trees? France? They go hand in hand? Mental reminder, don't put this clip in the video, it's very controversial and it might start a political debate. Instead, put a clip here instead asking for 10,000 like -a for the Palestine-Israeli war. Oh, lardy fucking dar, alright? Apparently Australia's too good for the Queen now and they've gone Republic, but joke's on you because you're gonna get fucking eye cancer looking at that flag all day. I just can't believe there's a whole continent down here. Just, fuck me, there's just so many provinces I've yet to fucking bomb. Okay, apparently France is a bit upset about the fact that all I gave them was trees when we invaded a fucking sovereign country, and now they've gone ahead and joined Saudi Arabia in the Shield Peninsula Gay Boy Force, and guess what? Why, come on France, what's wrong with trees? Why you gotta go get so sandy, huh? You got sandy in your vagina down there in Saudi Arabia. Am I, t am I not good enough for you? Europe, Europe leaving bros, no? I feel a bit hurt. Oh, what's that? You like your world extra spicy? Well, guess what? India and China are having a spice off and, and they're shooting each other. It's good, but Ying, Ying Ping over here, he's against... I'm not even gonna do it. Yeah, I just think if you're gonna go behind someone's back, you know, join a Arab Federation alliance down in the Middle East, you just do... BuzzFeed's top 10 list on how to get over a rough breakup. Okay, Iraq's been a fucking bitch and won't let me invade Saudi Arabia through their country, so I'm just gonna have to do the old German Tokyo drift around them through Belgium. Wait, sorry, Q8 this. Oh, what, Saudi Arabia? No, they're totally independent and haven't, you know, I haven't installed a foreign dictatorship liberal democrat alliance under Tim, Tim Farron, the demon. Yeah, we won't get into it. We won't get into it. Oh, this looks a bit different. Oh, look, there's another Liberal Democrat now in France. How did he get there? Wait, is that Albania? How did Albania get there? How, jeez, how, how did Albania get, that's a bit weird for Albania to be in, wait, never mind, he's got a sweet moustache, no wonder he's in France, he's, he fits in with all the other homosexuals. Oh, that's not nice, why would someone drop a bomb on this specific part of France? Ha was it an accident? Who did it? Why? My life has uh, it's lost, it's lost all purpose, so I'm just, uh, what, what am I even doing? I'm just dropping nukes on Tehran. That's, that's what I'm doing in life. Yeah, I don't know what fucking Mexicans Trump hired to build this wall, but look, it's shit. This, this is a, this is a shit wall the Mexicans are still getting in, Trump. Jesus. Yeah, I'm not quite sure what this, the Islamic State, what, what is that? What, what is that? What, where, where? What is the Islamic State? I don't have a fucking clue what you guys are on about. I can't see it. Is it there? Oh, no, that's Albania. You can always count on me, bro, good old, uh... 
Jim to give me some troops in my time. Oh. Oh, okay. Don't mind me just being a bit of a penis in the Middle East. Guys. <laughs> oh no, Albania's grown. How'd that happen? Dude, your moustache, it's got so big. It's so fluffy, so... Why does it smell so fucking weird? You know, I just realised I absolutely hate the modern day Millennium Dormart. I'd rather actually just stop playing it right now because I'm pretty sure I've been possessed by the... Wait, I can re- I can, I can reapply to join the EU. F fucking simple, mate. The, the demon of Tim Farron has fucking got itself inside of me through, through the dark arts. Um, I think I've been possessed, guys. Oh, they, they rejected my application. Okay. Hey guys, remember to leave a like for 10, 10 million likes and I'll join the EU, yo. Dude, make sure to follow my Instagram. My <laughs> oh, that was a bit weird. Dude, what the hell was that? Um, anyway, make sure to leave the video.